I'm Jessica. Welcome to my channel. I have a message for you guys today and it is about rising above. Okay. Now listen, before we start today, uh, if anyone would like a personal private reading, I'm offering those right now for a short time. Uh, you can go to my website, thecryptidhuntress.com and go to the shop section and you can book it right there. So you guys just, um, Please do that. It's been awesome. I have had such a wonderful response to that. And uh, thank you to everyone who's had a reading with me so far. It's been such a pleasure. And it's been a lot of fun for me. And uh, and I love it. And thank you all for trusting me to uh, give a little guidance. Okay. So I appreciate it. It means the world to me. Okay. Well, today we have um, Rising Above Clarity, Freedom, and Solution. And it just so happens to be number 11 on the card which is my life path number. And for anyone who uh, is not familiar with the life path number, um, you take your birth date and you, you dissect it into the different numbers like 5, 26, 19, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> I'm going to tell you all my real age. Uh, but anyways, you can figure it out, okay, because I'm on 11. But, um, but yeah, it's, um, yeah, you take that and you add up the numbers, and if it's like a double digit, you add those two numbers together, and then you get your your number and mine happens to be an 11 which breaks down to a 2 but you know it's originally an 11 so uh, there's a lot of meaning behind those numbers so you guys go check out find out what your angel numbers are yeah I got a birthday tomorrow so yeah yay me all right so um anyways this is all about rising above whatever you're going through right now okay like if there's something that you um you're going through like this is telling you to, to get a higher perspective on it okay there may be something that, like you're feeling like it's holding you down or like you're just stressed out about it this is saying rise above it like you are a hundred percent capable of rising above it getting a higher perspective and then like seeing the bigger picture and then if you need to take a break from it okay detach from whatever it is that you are worried about right now okay detach from it and uh and then the answers will come, okay? Sometimes when we focus on something like way too much and we put all of our energy into it and all of our power into it and everything is like, oh, I'm so worried, I'm so worried. Um, it makes it way worse, right? It doesn't do anything to help. So um, it's just like manifesting, you know, like if you're man wanting to manifest something, write it down, set it and forget it, okay? <laughs> like don't keep focusing on it like obsessively because It'll never manifest. It'll basically like run from you, just like with money. It's all an energy, you guys. Okay, so once we start learning that this is all, um, it's all about energy and kind of like manipulating energy a little bit or just, you know, going with the flow, uh, life will change for you as soon as you start realizing that. It has definitely changed for me in many ways. Okay, um, so yeah, just rise above it. I have an affirmation here. I actually pulled the book out. Let's see if I can find it. All right, so this is your affirmation for today. I surrender this situation to the universal power of love. I trust that all is well in my life. I look at my life from a higher perspective. I am divinely guided. All is clear in my life, and I am safe. All right, so I hope all of you guys feel good today. I hope that you all feel happy and safe and that you feel loved today, okay? Uh, it's all about rising above rising above whatever whatever you got on your mind okay and that includes people okay and relationships with people and things like that okay let me uh i'm gonna pull a couple of uh oracle cards to get some advice for you guys today okay follow your bliss navigating by the stars okay so this is navigating by the stars this is like the moon card kind of um had a dog hair on my card. Sorry. <laughs> my German Shepherd has been shedding because it's summertime. Um, okay. Follow your bliss. This is all about you doing what you love and, and following the stars. Look into the sky. Look to the sky for answers. It's like another, you know, uh, rising above, being in the sky. Um, look to the stars for answers, you know. Um, just follow your bliss. But hey, when you navigate the moonlight, that means you kind of keep it secret. Okay. So this is about not exposing everything that you're doing right now okay um maybe maybe you need to um 
keep it quiet, okay? Keep it quiet. Whatever, whatever you're dealing with right now, don't be posting it all over social media, okay? How about that? Uh, don't post it over social media. Um, keep it private, okay? All right, valiant courage. Take action with passion. Okay, it's time to take action, okay? It's time for you to rise above. Do it now, okay? And do it with passion. Um, you're going to find a solution when you take the action to... Um, to rise above okay to rise above your problems okay all right don't you're t you're making my camera shake buddy okay all right sorry my son is uh crawling on the floor right underneath the camera making it shake okay all right let's see all right yeah don't put all your business out there for everybody okay that's just a general rule we don't put our business out for everybody all the time um yeah Okay, magic works through you. Wow. You guys are magical beings, okay? Uh, I just learned something new about the scarab beetle the other day. Instead of flying with its wings, it levitates, okay? It's almost like the ancient Egyptians knew a little secret knowledge about that, right? I never knew they levitated. I thought they just flew around, right? They have like little wings, but really what they do is they levitate. So, um, yeah. It's time to, oh wow, we got another, so like the, the dove is flying in the sky, the beetle is levitating. Maybe you're about to take off, okay? You're ready, you're ready to fly, okay? You're ready to fly. Um, navigating by the stars, this is going to take a lot of, of valiant courage that you have. It's all within you already, okay? All right, and claim your independence, Okay. Ooh, and set healthy boundaries. Ooh, I like that card. Yeah, we all need to set healthy boundaries. That is a big deal, okay? Magic works through you. Set healthy boundaries and claim your independence. This is the kitty cat spirit, okay? Um, it's time for you to, you know, set healthy boundaries because probably people um, have not been, you know, let, let me back up. You're going to have better relationships with people the better boundaries you set, okay? You should not give everyone access to your energy, okay? Not everyone is entitled to your energy, okay? I've had to learn that the hard way myself, okay? So claim your independence, especially from people who are demanding your energy and not giving you anything in return, okay? Um, you, you know, your, your energy is your most precious commodity it's your most valuable commodity okay your energy your time okay so um claim your independence learn that you know you are to be respect not that you, you don't know you're not you know to be respected but um let other people know you know that you've got boundaries and you are not one to be messed with you you um you need to um Put up those boundaries, okay? Put up the boundaries. Uh, it'll it'll make your life easier, and it'll make it'll make people it'll make everyone's relationships better with you, um, because yeah, uh, once everybody gets a healthy dose of respect, and and you respect them back, and, and it's a it's a win win. It's a win win, okay? Win win situation. I need to watch my words, Donna. It says watch your words. <laughs> I have to be careful what I say. <laughs> oh my gosh, yeah. Um, just, um, yeah, rise above, baby, rise above, and watch your words, be, be gentle, be gentle with your words, okay, how about that, okay, um, but yeah, set those boundaries, okay, let's get one last card for the day, oh my gosh, I had this card in a reading earlier today, balance, wow, it's like a general energy today. This is a, an amazing energy. It says, I bring a state of perfect harmony into my world and I do so without judgment. Yes. Bring balance into your world. And that's physical balance. It's mental balance. It's um, spiritual. Like be, be balanced in every facet of your life. Um, you know, uh, all work and no play m makes for a really uh, grumpy person sometimes. Okay. <laughs> so, be sure you're getting a balance of like work life and play life and, you know, love and, uh, and all that stuff. Make sure your, you know, your chemicals are balanced. <laughs> okay. Make sure, uh, your emotions are balanced. And that's all about, um, 
you know, uh, rising above and finding that clarity that you need sometimes, okay? And, and by doing that, you know, you got to balance out like being stressed out by taking a break, okay? Taking a break and, and the answers will come to you, okay? It's all, it's all a balancing act, okay? All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this wacky message by Jessica. <laughs> it was fun. And uh, yeah, if anyone would like a personal reading, I actually um, do a tarot reading. So I actually use my tarot cards and I I, um, I get a little more specific on my private reading. So um, if anyone's interested, uh, it has been really fun. I um, have completely enjoyed them. Please uh, sign up on my website. And, uh, and I have those readings out within 24 hours. And... Uh, it's really cool, private and um, personal, okay? So I hope you guys have a wonderful day. I hope that you'll join me on Friday night on Remote Viewing Investigations with Jessica. I am remote viewing the Giant of Kandahar, um, which is really awesome. You know, giants have roamed this earth for, for millions of years probably, who knows? <laughs> and uh, There may or may not have been one uh, that the military special forces encountered in Afghanistan in 2002. So we're going to look into that. You guys join me. Also, this weekend on Space Talk Radio at 10 p.m. Eastern Time, I have Fred Roll from Alaska uh, coming on to talk about Alaskan subarctic Sasquatch. And that Saturday night, Sunday night, I have Stacy Brown Jr. coming on to talk about the occult in Skunk Ape. So it's going to be awesome. I hope you guys will join me. Until then, I'm sending lots of love and light, and uh, I will see y'all soon. Bye.